So today we're going to look at some good grape cuttings and figure out why one set survived, the other set died. These, these grape cuttings were taken at the same time, same type of grape, put in the same shady place, um, given the same amount of water, and all of these died and most of these survived. I found that grapes are pretty easy to propagate, almost as easy as figs, and so something clearly went wrong with these and we're going to look and figure out why. Uh, the first thing I noticed is that these ones are quite a bit taller than these ones. These have some new growth, so they're kind of hard to tell, but they're kind of down in here. These ones are all the way up in here. If you pull one of these out, it's already pulled out. Uh, you can see it's almost two feet long. Probably is about two feet long. And um, it has about six inches in the soil. Ideally, you want to try to get as much down in the soil as you can so that you've got different nodes that can have roots come out of them and all stays moist. And you don't need much above the soil because it's just going to dry out anyway. So these cuttings are too long. I would have cut these probably to a foot or foot and a half. That's where most of these are, and they're obviously doing a lot better. Um, and then also these pots don't have as much soil on them as these other pots. So you want to try to get as much of the cutting underground as you can for really a couple of nodes. That would be in these spots where leaves or roots would form. Um, and then hopefully that'll increase your odds. Um, and they're looking more like this rather than this. Um, just really, you just got to cut them, put them in a dark place, get enough soil on them, and. They, they work out pretty well.